Welcome back everybody. Welcome to the channel. My name is Dylan Space Cadet Crypto and today we're going to be talking about the Shiba price because we do see huge huge action moving up from down all the way here all the way up here. So we're going to be talking about this huge pump and what that means for the price of Shiba in the next coming days and the reason why the Coinbase listing did make such a huge move for the Shiba token and a lot of other co uh, coins too that have been added to Coinbase. So we're going to talk about all that today. So remember if you are new to the channel remember to like and subscribe turn on bell notifications so you don't miss on any important news without further ado let's jump right in okay so the news started right here with coinbase pro announcing that they're going to be offering chili's keep network and ship they're going to be available in the regions where trading is supported traders cannot place orders and no orders will be filled trading will begin after 9 a.m pt on thursday 6 17. so this is very important to look out for and i'll tell you why in just a minute but let's take a look deeper into this article all right it says here that chili's Keep Network and Shiba Inu are launching on Coinbase Pro starting today, Tuesday, June 15th. You can transfer Chili's Keep and Ship into your Coinbase account Pro, the Pro edition. Remember, it's not the regular Coinbase because there's two versions. There's, where's my fingers? <laughs> there's two, there's Coinbase and Coinbase Pro. Now, Coinbase is, the main difference between the two, I can think of right off the top of my head, would be that one has more fees. Coinbase Pro doesn't have any fees when you're trading. But Coinbase does have a lot more fees and a lot more people use Coinbase, but they don't really know too much about Coinbase Pro. But they're essentially the same thing, except Pro has less trading fees. And it says here they're going to be adding it on the Pro network. So Chili's Keep and Ship are added. And it says here they will be beginning trading on 9 a.m. Pacific Standard Time, Thursday, June 17th. And always, it's always buy the rumor, sell the news. So what I mean by that is Chili's keep and ship are all being listed today that's why the price is rising up people are buying the rumor or in this case it is happening but so-called the rumor right my yeah the rumor so that means that the price is going to pump today but what is it going to actually happen on thursday june 17th well i do expect a sell-off and let me give you a reason why and a lot of people are going to be asking like well if they're adding in you can trade now why is it going to sell off well people are always going to stick to that notion of buy the rumor and sell the news meaning they're buying right now because of the news and then they're selling when it actually does come out and it trades on 9 a.m pacific standard time thursday june 17th so expect that and let me just give you an example of what i mean by that but let's continue reading real quick we do see that one of the most common requests we receive from customers is to be able to trade more assets on our platform per the terms of our listing process we anticipate supporting more assets that meet our standards over time. We've recently added all these different tokens like DOT, Dogecoin was a big one. And remember, Dogecoin received that same Coinbase pump when it was announcing that it was releasing Dogecoin onto Coinbase Pro and Coinbase. And then what happened when Ash started trading? It did go lower again. And we do see ICP, Internet Computer, all these major tokens and coins have been released on Coinbase Pro, which is awesome to see. And now we're seeing SHIB add that too. So this is giving more legitimacy to SHIB. Now, the reason why Coinbase gives more legitimacy to it is that they do more of a thorough background check on coins than, let's say, Binance. Because, because if you look right here, Binance did post risk warnings to SHIB when they first listed it. It said that SHIB is a relatively new token that presents a higher risk than normal. The innovation zone, which is where they added SHIB to, is a dedicated trading zone where users are able to trade innovative tokens that are likely to have higher volatility and pose a higher risk than other tokens. So they know that SHIB is going to be moving very high up and very high down. And so they're posing these risks here. So like I said, Binance, even though they are a leading exchange, it doesn't necessarily mean that they are the best in finding out which coins are actually worth investing in they just add whatever is popular right now and they put it in this innovation zone saying that they're uh, more likely to be high volatility with these tokens so they're giving the risk out there but coinbase is actually a little bit different they do have more protocols in place when they're adding tokens so this is actually great news for any ship holder out there now the reason i do say that ship token is going to drop on thursday when it does start trading is we had a similar thing happen to Cardano. Now, if we look here, let's read. It says, starting Tuesday, March 16th, transfer ADA into your Coinbase Pro account ahead of support or ahead of trading. Support for ADA will be available in Coinbase's support in jurisdictions and trading will begin 
on 9 a.m pacific standard time thursday march 18th doesn't that sound kind of familiar like we just read here for sheba and chilies right here right so it's always released and then two days later right we do see that it starts trading now if we look back here over cardano's launch march 16 is when they announced right right here march 16 is when they announced that they're going to be launching cardano on march 18th now let's take a look at the charts and see what actually did happen if you look here okay so we're back here in march this right here this was march 15th and right when they announced it we saw this huge move to the upside right there march 16th you can see that right down below march 16th so let's measure that move so once they announced it it went up 42 percent okay and now when did it actually start going down let's zoom in a little bit more okay so march 16th right here came all the way up and then when did it start going down right here march 18th march 18th that's when we saw a huge decline in the price going back to actually where it was before around this one dollar area but it did go all the way up to a dollar and fifty cents almost when the release of the news happened so this is why i'm saying to be very cautious on buying this news right now we him we have probably already seen most of the gains that are going to happen because of this news but of course it can still go up like cardano did over the last two days before it actually started trading so till thursday we can still see momentous move to the upside but i just wanted to warn everybody here just because i saw this many times and times before when coinbase does list a new token it's not necessarily a good thing but as soon as the the news does come out that is a very good thing because it just pumps up it already went up 40 percent today shiba and as we saw cardano did the same thing went up 42 percent but then right when it started trading on the 18th here it started to go all the way back down to its previous lows here at a dollar so be wary of that i just want to give everybody a word of caution but this is still great news we're having more to their exchanges so that is awesome to see more exchanges are adopting more credible exchanges are adopting shiba token like coinbase which is what we want to see but let's jump into the price because that's what's actually important right now let's see what shiba token is doing right now okay like i said before we had this huge massive pump let's measure this move from a swing low here back june 12 all the way up to when the news was released we had a 94 percent move to the upside so in just five days here or three days actually almost four days we've seen a 94 percent move to the upside which is crazy to see now let's take a look at all our levels so so what you can see here is we did have a massive move to the downside this weekend because Bitcoin was weak. But what we did see is a nice pump Sunday night and Monday. We still started trading higher and higher. Our volume is still kind of low. As you can see, let me zoom in a little bit on the volume. But if you can see right here, our volume is starting to pick up now, which is good because of this massive news of Coinbase listing Shiba. So we did have a nice V-shaped recovery back above these levels because like I said in my previous videos, I said we have to hold this blue box of support where time and time again, we've seen the price bounce off right here, here as well. Here it tried to, but it was too weak and it broke down. And if we actually did find this as resistance, this would be huge resistance to break. And it was very, very fortunate for us that we did actually manage to trade through this blue box resistance and start trading as support so only time will tell now because we did look we found a wick perfectly to my blue box right up here at that 10 level that point zero 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 ten level like a lot of people have been saying in the shiba army burning that zero having only four zeros now we did see that momentarily but we did get a rejection off that price but we still saw the price move up more this is a six hourly chart by the way so we are seeing that rejection right here we saw rejection here and here before so it's still very strong resistance and we have to wait until we actually get once we broke out of this yellow descending line which i said yesterday was very very important for us to actually break through we did come back and retest this area now we have to come back here and retest this descending line of resistance which was resistance here and up here and up here we have to test it as support so what we want to see is we want to see this bounce down here move back up 
and then continue on further to retest these upper areas like we saw many times before so that's what it's looking like let's look at our moving averages as well we do see that we are actually above all of our moving averages for the six hour chart which is great because we do see that it is continuing on further which is what you know it gives a strong confirmation that we are in a bull run right now so and like i said before a 94 percent move to the upside is insane so if you bought down here you've already doubled your money you know, put 100 bucks in you would have gotten 200 bucks out uh yet again not financial advice but this is crazy that we saw this news perfect timing because if we were getting another rejection we would have gone even lower so this would have been perfect time also for shiba swap news to come out we haven't heard too much yet but this coinbase pro listing is great news enough all right so what we're seeing expecting is a retrace back down here to this descending resistance coming back up and bouncing off further if we do manage to break below we start trading back down here and then start trading back here then we're going to be stuck in this range for a little bit longer but this range right here between these two blue boxes is what i think we're going to be trading in for the next couple days at least till the end of this week until we uh get more momentum to move towards the upside and start trading these higher areas but if we zoom out here you can see that we've been trading in this range for such a long time broke down and now we're trading back in this range so i think we're going to trade in this range go up higher until we break this blue box resistance fully we have to make this support so we have to see we have to see a move out break out of this blue box and then act as support and then move on further so that's what we're looking for today but great news we had a nice pump if we look here on the one hourly we can just see how we're just actually we can see how we kind of did retest we found this as slight support and now we're moving a little bit higher so this is cool to see here too we did see a move up this red candle right here with a long you see that long wick at the very bottom of it that's a pretty bullish wick because it means that we did break out of this yellow resistance fell back below but the price actually went back up and closed slightly above it and now we're starting to close even further away from this so this actually could be the confirmation that i was talking about we'll have to see if this holds because as we know this can also confirm twice too we can see another comeback to confirming this resistance as support so i will be updating on this channel remember if you are a shiba holder and you want to stay informed with the latest price updates make sure to like and subscribe to this channel so this reaches out more people i am so grateful for the 8,000 subscribers that i got so far i'll be uploading as much content as i can even more content now but that is it for this video thank you so much peace out